Hello, Prosper ISD, Dr. Holly Ferguson coming to you from the beautiful PHS, also known as Prosper High School or Home of the Eagles. Behind me, we have our softball girls and they are playing and practicing on brand new turf. And as you can hear, they're very excited about it. So I'm excited about it as well. We also have brand new turf on our baseball field as well as over on our green monster. Uh, which is the big wall that we try to hit all the home runs over. We have a brand new painting of the Prosper Eagle. So I hope that you'll get out hopefully soon to many of our sporting events to be able to see all of these great athletic updates. We also have a brand new track at PHS for all of our runners. And so we have a brand new surface that is just nice and beautiful and ready for our kids to, to take the lanes and win. We also have many upgrades on the inside. As we all know, PHS is known for academic and athletic excellence under the leadership of Dr. John Burdett, our principal. And inside of the facility, you'll find that all of the old Promethean boards have been removed and they've been upgraded with brand new televisions in each of the classrooms so that the whole visual appearance of instruction as well as what the kids are seeing and able to interact with is really state of the art. And so we're very, very fortunate that we had the bond money to be able to do these projects. Also, when you get a moment to come into PHS, once our COVID-19 restrictions are lifted, you'll notice that there's brand new carpet throughout all of the hallways, as well as our library has gone through a complete and total renovation. And probably one of the most exciting things that we have happening in the PHS library is that we're turning that into a future ready design space for our kids. So they can really think about the challenges and the things that they want to explore and learn more about, and then be able to have tools and equipment, and then to highly, highly trained staff members through Mrs. Hutt as well as Mrs. Miller to help facilitate that learning and really push them to the next level of problem solving. So we're very excited about all of the upgrades that had happened at PHS and in Prosper ISD and that is because of each of you saying yes to a bond election to give us the ability to be able to provide our kids with the absolute best equipment and the best facilities in the state of Texas. So, you all may have seen last week in the PISD Express that we had a COVID-19 website that gave you on-demand information about positive COVID cases by campus. It also gave you statistics about how many staff members and the percentage that are affected or impacted by a positive case, as well as the number of students. I strongly encourage you to, to visit that website to be able to stay in tune with what's happening across Prosper ISD. And we will also, to make it easier for you as a parent parent or a community member in the district, we'll have that linked in the PISD Express every Friday with the most current and up-to-date information that we have. So I hope that you'll visit that site as well as read all of the great information that is in the PISD Express. I also want to remind you that September 4th, this Friday, it is a professional learning day. So our students have the day off kind of. We have assessment day at the elementary level, so we'll be asking for the students to come in so our teachers can give them individualized attention regarding their academic progress and where they currently are. We also will have professional learning occurring at our middle school and high school level. And then on Monday, September 7th, we actually will not have any school for any of us. It will be a break, which is uh, I think something that the staff and the students and the parents are all looking forward to which will give us an additional day to recharge our batteries and then to head back into school on September 8th. I think that's about all the time that I have for today and I hope that you've gotten a good feel of all of the great things going on at PHS. I know I've loved being here today with our students and I want to remind you, we are prosper and we are one. <laughs>